What is up everyone? Today we're gonna be checking out the archetype Abasi by Neuro DSP. So following the signal chain, the first thing that you have is two pedals. You have a compressor pedal and a distortion pedal, which is the Logos and the Patos. The Logos is really cool, really simple to use. You have just a compressor knob, tone, very simple. With the Patos, it's not an overdrive pedal, it's not something to push your amp. It's basically another channel. It kind of fully distorts the sound. It can be used really nicely with the clean amp. Followed by that, you have the amps. I'll start with the clean one. The clean amp is really nice. You can use it for really clean sounds, ambient sounds. You can also use the distortion pedal to get another high gain sound and you can fine tune all the controls on the amp and on the pedal. <laughs> Still on the clean amp, you have a blend knob, which also blends the signal of the amplifier with the signal of a processed DI, which sounds a little bit like a piezo or something like a, an acoustic sound. Followed by that, you have the first amp, which is very high gain. You have lots of distortion. It's very clear. And something different about this amp is that you have a tight knob, which you can actually control a little bit more your low end. <laughs> Okay, the third amp has much more gain than the second one. It also has much more mids. And I think that it's centered around playing leads. But you can also get really nice rhythm sounds with that. <laughs> There's 
there's also too many switches for each amp which is a low and a high shelf boost where you can basically give a slightly different distortion so when you're playing the amp responds differently so you can get a large variety of sounds after that you have one independent 9 band EQ for each amp you also have a cab section, if you already know the Neuro plugins, you might be very familiar, where you can choose your mics, the position of the mic, you can choose if you want to blend microphones, if you want to load your own impulse responses. And after that, you have two more pedals, which is a reverb pedal and a delay pedal. Okay, so let's check out some other sounds as well. So, really hope you guys enjoyed it. In my opinion, this is one of the best plugins that I've ever played in my entire life. I just love how it responds really well. I don't know, it just responds like a real amp. I love the low end in this specific plugin. I don't know why, but I just love it. I feel like you can get a already mixed sound inside the plugin, just like any other Neuro plugins. But in my opinion, this is the one that I kind of resonate the most. Even the preset sounds absolutely amazing. And I wanted to know what you guys think. So leave your comment down below. Let me know what is your favorite plugin of 2019. And really hope to see you guys soon.